Madam Speaker, the Prime Minister continues to stick with Stephen Harper's climate change targets that will not meet our international commitments. Worse, Environment Canada recently projected that we are set to miss even that low bar, exceeding our 2030 target by at least 30 per cent. And this was before the Liberals announced delays in implementing key measures, including the methane emission control regulations and the $1.2 billion to support climate action by the provinces. The solution is clear, ambitious targets, credible measures to deliver them, and transparency in reporting. When will Canadians see these actions? The Honourable Member for Environment and Climate Change. Thank you, Madam Speaker. I'm extraordinarily proud of the climate change plan that we were able to negotiate with the provinces and territories in consultation with Indigenous peoples. This includes putting a price on pollution, making polluters pay. This includes phasing out coal by 2030. This includes historic investments in public transit, in green infrastructure, in adaptation. This includes working with Indigenous communities to get them off diesel. This includes historic investments in clean innovation. This will create good jobs and opportunities, and we are extremely proud, and we are going to be moving forward. Thank you.